All right, guys. Welcome back to another episode of of uh, Grim Dom. I almost said grab. Um, let's take a look. Clean out our inventory here. I don't think we have a whole lot that uh, is really super great right now. I'm going to go ahead and drop these components off in the chest. Whoops. And then we will uh, get our pet summoned up and we'll go ahead and uh, keep on moving on. Whoops. We need those. Eh, yeah, we'll probably need those too. Combine stuff that we have in here. Let's see. Oh, we can wear an amulet, so we're going to go ahead and put that on for sure. We'll sell that one. Hmm. That's got an 8 health regen on it. I think we're going to go ahead and put that one on in place of our gold. That. Alright, that should help out quite a bit. Uh, we do kind of want to look into getting a better weapon at some point here. But, uh, we'll do that as we go. I'm going to go ahead and we're going to try and get through uh, the town as quickly as possible and get on with the quest. I know we've kind of been stuck in this area a little bit. Alright, first let's get our pet up. Get our buff triggered. Alright, let's get on through town. See how much we can get done here. do want to try and get into the mansion so we can move on with the quest a little bit here. Go up here and kill these guys real quick. Now I have been considering something. I'm considering Swapping back down from veteran mode just so we can get progressed into the story because it seems like we're spending a lot more time uh, kind of getting stuck places and I really want you guys to be able to see see the full story. Oop, I need to buy health potions. Rather than watching me uh, fumble around, I want to make sure you guys get a, get a good experience, a good feel for the... Uh, for the game and uh, get a good look at it. So I may consider doing that. Um, I'm not too worried about the game being too difficult. Um, I enjoy the challenge. But I think uh, you guys seeing me replay the same area over and over and over kind of uh, dulls it for you guys. So we might... Uh, that's a rock we can knock over. Yeah. Give us health potion, so that's good. But, uh, I, I think I might do that uh, probably next episode just to kind of speed things up a bit. Let's get these guys dead and we'll move on. get through these guys pretty quickly. Whew. We've uh, unlocked a horde here. Now let me know if uh, if you guys are bored with this and, and want me to move on to something else and I'll see what I can work out. Um, if this guys if this uh, these episodes aren't entertaining you, let me know and I, I will uh, uh, see what else I can put in its place. I know that sometimes these aren't the most exciting videos. All right, 
almost made it back through town. Try not to take too much time wandering around. And that fury takes forever to kill. Our mana pool's in certainly in uh, much better shape than it was before. So we put a couple of points into that. It's helped quite a bit. All right, let's rest for just a second. Let our health build back up. Almost there. Let's go ahead and move on. Let's get this done here. Nice good first opening hit. Quite a bit of stuff killed off. The spell, despite it being uh, very heavy on the mana usage, has done uh, fantastically for us. Stuff creeping out here. Right there. Let's go ahead and keep moving on. Alright, up in the estates. Oop, I didn't step out of the way fast enough. I'm gonna go ahead and buy some health potions while I'm in town, I think. That's a pretty good stack here. Um, let's go with 30. May as well go ahead and clean out our inventory while we're here, too. Uh, don't like that. Let's say, okay, I have one mana potion left, so I'm gonna go buy a couple of those as well. Alright. Let's get back on the road here. Alright, I'll walk through this real quick. Get our bus turned back on. Meander back up to where we were here. done. Somebody throwing something at us over here. Take care of that. Let's get back up into the estates. A little bit of our XP back. There we go. Much better that time around. Alright, nothing we really need there. We'll at some point probably start hiding that lower level loot because we're not using it nearly as much as we were right there in the beginning. Let's 
see what we've got here. Not helpful. And that's a shield. We'll go ahead and pick these up. We can sell them. I'm not too worried about selling the white stuff. We already went into this house and dealt with this guy, so we're going to keep going. Now one thing I have learned that's rather important, after you defeat a boss in this game, make sure you keep going on through his room, because typically there's a way into the next area from his, uh, wherever the boss is located. Um, we've missed that a couple of times in, uh, in solo game. I can't do that yet. Not ready for a potion. Okay, our health regen's doing us good. There we go. Um, but we've had to come back through and fight the bosses again, so it's pretty important to go ahead and go through and try and get that next waypoint before you hop back to town after a boss fight. Get out of there! A little bit too much damage. Mostly because of these guys. like our pet's gone down. We'll go ahead and bring him back. Break through these real quick. Alright, now we are in the house proper. Not helpful, but we'll sell it. Nothing good in that crate. I think we're getting pretty close to our quest location. Somebody's still shooting at us. Alright, let's go on up here. I have noticed in this particular map, I don't think potions drop quite as often from chests as I would like. Um, I understand the increased difficulty, but it seems like there's a drastic difference between uh, normal difficulty and this one as far as like the, the potion drops from boxes and crates and stuff. It looks like our quest is back up the road a little bit. We're not quite far enough up. Alright, let's go back up here. We're stuck in this corner. Cellar, but that's not where not the cellar we're going for. Excellent first hit. Good opening salvo. Lightning strike makes uh, for really well attack when you've got them all bunched up like that. I think, let's take a look at our map real quick here. Let's say our quest is back here somewhere. Excellent time for a level up. We filled our health bar for us. Next 
excellent, excellent. It's not anything we're really interested in. All right, this is the location that we were going for. Out of there a little bit. There's too much fire in this little corridor right here. That's not helpful. Uh, it's better armor, but we lose some damage. Uh, we'll think about it. That's not worth it at all. There's that. Pick up our lore bonus. Pretty good. Let's go upstairs. Pop off our skills that help needle them down. Still have one hitting on me. Will I? Being attacked. Don't need that. Oh man, these guys are annoying. Gotcha. Right, silver amulet, not super useful. Get our pet back up again. More cold guys. Awesome. This one. Alright, we're at our quest location on down the stairs. Alright guys, since we're here, we have made it to a new location. We are in the warden's basement, it's where our first boss is located. Uh, but I think we're gonna do the first boss next episode. Alright guys, I appreciate you coming by and checking out the episode. Please do leave a like down below if you enjoyed it. Let me know your opinions of the series. If you're bored with it, like me to move on or something like that, let me know. Uh, leave those comments down below, please. On another note, if you would please leave a, a subscribe on your way out. That would help me out a ton. I'd really, really, really appreciate it. Alright guys, we'll see you next time.